Hey guys, it's Dally, and welcome to episode 2 of our River Valley XXL series. Uh, so at the end of the Lapis episode, I was um, basically farming for, or not farming, mowing grass, and then I sold the grass, and right after I did that, I realized that I should probably just turn it into silage, right? I'll get if 8 times the money at least, um, so I'm going to make sure I do that from now on. Uh, currently, I'm going back to the barn here and cutting all these guys off um, because I want to sell a lot of uh, what we have just sitting around. Um, so I'm hoping I can go this way, not cross the bridge, and just kind of follow the beach back to the farm. Um, so we're going to find out. Hope that works. But yeah, um, so the plan game plan today is going to be to focus on basically turning as much money around as possible. Oh wow, this looks a little more intimidating than I was expecting. Come on, truck, you can do it. Alright, let's back it up and then turn off to the side here. Alright, so that's... That is absolutely not going to work. Uh, let's bring up the map. Alright, so we'll have to double back here. Um, I might be able to break through to our left here. And... Basically cut across because this does not look as scary um, because I do need to cross this little river here um, so since I'm already across it um, we might be okay I might be able to actually cut through again a large spacious area that could have grass on it um, we'll see I might be able to plant the grass uh, to make up for the lack of it uh, that's my hope anyway so that way we can get the most bang for our buck. Um, I did find where uh, the Gomez Ridge Acres I, um, is, and it's actually not far away. It's down by Field 24. Uh, so if you look, it's just uh, to the south of the store. So it's actually not that inconvenient. Um, so we'll definitely go sell the uh, sunflower here, um, and that'll get us some good money. See if I can make it up this little hill here, and then I'll be on the road. Come on, they're, they're just tippers, empty tippers at that. There we go, we're getting through. All right, yep. So I'm gonna pick that up. Um, I'll catch back up with you um, when we are on our way. Actually, probably when we get to the Gomez Ridge Acres. So, made those cells. Um, I've been playing with uh, course play, so apologize for not getting back to you earlier. Uh, but yeah, uh, making sure I get some good course play courses set up. Um, right, so we get the most out of basically this process here. Um, so I'm going to do... 
access to field 46. All right, so I'm going to leave it there for now. Um, so that gave me a small loop. Um, one of the things I wanted to do was sell this combine. So let's go ahead and drive it over the store. Um, and we'll do more course play as we drive over there. Um, we invest just a tiny bit of time uh, in uh, everything. So whenever we're driving around, see if there's a way we could make it a course play course um, and that will save us a whole lot in the long run um, oh I should probably get my cedar here um, so let's what crop do we want to do let's do so we have canola and soybean um, right now soybeans got a better price than canola But we could also do more wheat and barley. Um, let, let's keep a crop diversity. So we'll do barley. Okay. Alright, so now let's grab the combine and move them over. Alright, so... Play. Um, we'll probably say field 15 is here, um, so we'll probably do field 15 to field, or to the next thing, which will probably be field 21. Okay, so we'll do it here. I like that, or field 14, sorry. Um, we gotta be careful because of this ledge right there. Um, so we're gonna cut this a little tight. Um, just make sure that we don't pull 14 this way. Right, so field 14. So we'll say this is to field 17 on this corner here. So field 14 to field 17. Stop. Field 14 to field 17.
this might actually be more good for this. Yeah, because this will let me have more lineup as we go. Yep, yeah, because this is the route that the cows took there. So we will sync up with them. Oop. Oop. Uh, the wide turns aren't a bad thing uh, when we get to bigger. Right, when we start getting the 18 wheelers and things, they'll have to take wide turns, so we want to make sure we're not cutting it tight. Otherwise, we're just, the, we'll have to redo some of the courses. So the real question is, where did I stop it? I want to say I stopped it on the second alcove thing. Uh, but I'm not entirely sure. So I'm just going to stop it on the first one. Okay, and we came from field 17. Okay, so stop. Field 17 to the store. Okay. This. Alright, let's get rid of this combine. Alright. Okay. There we go. All right, perfect. So we'll need a new combine. Um, that new combine will be uh, something bigger um, that we'll lease. Because really, why not? Um, we're trying to speed this up as fast as possible, so um, we might as well just go all out. That's a lot of money, but um, I think we'll recoup it pretty quickly. Um, we won't do it right now. I think first I'm going to grab another tractor that's going to use a plow. Um, so we'll do that first. So I do like these plows, this mod. Um, so I'm probably going to use them. Right, because they're nice, straight, uh, easy to manage plows. Um, so yeah, let's do that. This one is going to require a tractor with 375 horsepower. Uh, that's a bit excessive for our needs right now. Uh, so we'll do the smaller version. Uh, yep, we'll do this one. So 225 horsepower. So we'll buy this. And let's see, 225. The first one to break 225 is All right, this case. All right. So 225. We'll just do the standard setups for all of these. We will lease the tractor. Okay, and then we will also buy a weight. Um, how big of a weight do we need? Probably not that substantial. Um, I'm going to go with the... Eh. Screw it, I'll just go all the way. Alright, so here is our new equipment here. Yep, that is a very big plow. Which I am fairly excited for. And we have the big tractor here. Alright, so now we're going to want to set a course play up that's going to take us back. Um, so I'll have the course play. This be the start um, for the store, and the entrance to the store will be there because it's a straight line between them. So. Alright, so we are going to make a new course. It's going to take us to field uh, 
17, I believe. I suppose I can stop here. Do field 20. Stop. Save. It's going to be a store to field 20. Okay. Cut this and then let's start recording. So now we're doing field 20 to field 17. Um, I gotta be careful with this recording just because I have a slightly wider implement on here. Um, but hopefully we get there pretty quickly. With not too much trouble, uh, this bridge is probably gonna be our biggest problem point, but I think we are okay. Okay, and it looks like the cedar finished, so that's good. Okay. Alright, so that was field 20 to field 17, which is about here. So we'll stop, so 20 to 17. Field 20 to field 17. Okay. Alright, now we will start recording a new course. That will be field 17. Back to field 14. Uh, this one is one that's going to be a little word. We played that tight. Okay, now this is going to be a very important turn that we have to set up. So, right, because we don't want to cut it too close to the edge because course play is not the best with certain ledges like this. All right, so I think that'll be all right. Um, we'll see when we have something that's a bit faster. All right. So field 14 to field, or field 17 to field 14. 17 to field 14. Okay. And since we're here, um, let's set up a new one. Start course recording. It'll be 14 to 15. stop here. Yeah, I think this is a good place to stop. Okay. So, 14 to field 15. 14 to field 15. Okay, awesome. So, let's see. The cedar's done. So, let's move him over here. Just park him right here for now. Okay, so one of the things I want to do is extend the fields. So let's extend this one. So let's do here. I want to go, right, so I'm going to use the compass right there. I want to go pretty much at exactly one or 270. So let's, let's see if we can align it there. Alright, so that's pretty close. Um, I think we're in a pretty good spot. So let's lower. Okay, allow create new field. We will go really slowly. Um, so we can basically make sure that we keep roughly that 270 mark. So 
question now is where does the field creation? It looks like it is on this triangle, which is a little unfortunate. Okay, so we're going to undo this, lift this up, um, flip around. ourselves up. Uh, so we want to be 90 facing this way. I think right here. So let's lower. Allow create fields. Let's back it up just a smidgen. Come on. There we go. So that is pretty close. Um, we have a little bit extra here that we can cut off. But now, we're going to grab our seeder. Have him seed that plowed section there. Now that we have expanded our field. Uh, just an extra row. Um, I think it's too much for him to do in one pass. Oh, no, we might be able to do it. Yeah, we should probably do it. Set you right in the middle here. There we go. And now our field is wider. Okay. Now, once we get rid of these trees, uh, which we'll have to do next. Time. We can also look at expanding field 15 further this direction. We don't want to do the other one because that's going to crowd the road. Um, but we will do it in this direction. So same deal. Um, we're going to be looking at 270 degrees as our direction. Okay. There. Go forward just a little bit. Yep, so we're destroying a little bit of crop, but that is okay. We can live with it. this easier. So we want to go 360 or 0. I don't know what it's going to say. Yeah, it's just 0. With this, so let's line it up roughly. Nah, I think we want to go a little in further. Okay. So let's look at this. Let you create new stuff. further. Okay. So we do need to go slightly wider. So we'll re-enable out create fields and see if we get slight I got right this way. If we can get the oh, here or not. So let's back it up. Alright, I'm trying to get it to where the field looks the same. Uh, the performance might be very similar. Uh, but looks is a lot of battle. Okay, so it's not limited to fields. Here we go. Alright. Let's work in that extra line there. 
Okay. Disable and then lift it. Alright, so I believe this is the angle we want. So we want 90 degrees, which we're pretty much at. Lower this. Okay, allow create new field. Okay, and then let's do this drive here. Yep, that's right. The huge map, and we are adding to these itty bitty fields. So let's see, we'll pull forward just a little more. Okay, let's disable. Lift. Okay, yep, that looks pretty good. Alright, so let's. Line ourselves up this direction. Let's go 180, I believe is what we want. Okay, let's just line it up. Lower like this. Back it up just a smidgen. Allow it to create the new fields and drive up here. So we, there we go. And now we have the easy job. We just fill this in. Right? We don't have to be as precise since we are with inside that boundary. So we just go for it. All right. And this will be nice. Right? We'll get a bit extra crop. Right, which again is more money and all of that, so I'm excited for it. Looks like we missed a tiny little patch over there. Uh, we won't fret. Uh, we'll probably just let it sit. Uh, eventually, 15 will shoot all the way out down here. Alright, so we lift. Make sure it doesn't create a field, right? Because if we tip over anything, basically if this touches the ground in any way, it's going to create a field. We don't want to make a mess if we don't have to. Alright. And this will finish off our expansion on field 14. What would be really cool is if it updated the map. Um, but I don't think it does. I believe the map is a static image. Uh, what did we plant in 14? Was it canola? Um, we'll check when we're done because we're going to put the cedar on this section here. And there we go. Turn this off. There we go. Perfect. Alright, so we planted on that field. Field 14. Let's see. It looks like canola. It is canola. Alright. Alright, you. Yeah. So let's put you on canola. And we will have you on this field. Alright. That. Uh, you went a little wide, but that's okay. Alright. Perfect. So he's doing it. Alright, so let's get... Do we have anything else we can sell? Uh, we have corn, and we have barley. Um, so let's see. Barley, Mary's Farm, corn, maize at the mill. What's the price of corn at that... F Mary's Farm? Um, it's not a great price for corn over there. Um, okay, so we probably won't sell anything then. Um, how are we doing on time? Okay, so we're getting kind of close. Um, so 
I'm gonna take this tractor over to somewhere where we can produce silage. Um, so we'll go to the biogas, I believe. Um, let's see, biogas plant. Okay. So the biogas plant over there is that that looks like that's actually where it is, but let's let's double check that. Um, since we can teleport, we can know before we get there. Visit. Okay, good. And there are there is some good field, um, so we can start filling this up with uh, grass. So that's that's the plan, guys. Um, so well, we can use the course play to get this guy going some distance so we want to go from the farm to field 54 and then let's see so what could we do field 54 and then we want to add field 47 and that's I think that puts us at the bridge um, so we will have you drive that course and you will stop the last point Okay, good. So he should get into position. Wait, what is my cedar doing? Why did you not like that end point? Yeah, I get why you're not doing that little strip, but there's this small piece here. Um, so let's see if I can line him up to do this. Almost there, come on. Okay, I think we can do all of this in one pass here. And yep, you will let me. Nope, a little more. Let's see if I can trick him into doing this strip here. All right, I'm not. I'm not gonna bother. It's it's not pulling much seed, so we'll be done there. Let's see how you're doing. Okay, you're going, so that's good settings um, oh, speed so street speed is automatic oh, yeah, he's going as fast as he can okay good because that's not as fast as I was going expanded those fields. Um, can we expand field this field over here? I don't think so. Um, I don't think there's a lot of options on expanding this field. Um, unless we expand it to the side there once the trees are gone. Um, so we'll want to look at clearing out the tree space there. In the meantime, I'm going to send you um, so you came from 46, so 46 to cows, where's that stop point? Okay. So we'll start a new one here, which will be cows to field 47, which is at that far end by the bridge. Deceptive, yes, because we are passing field 47. see in front of us there that the mower and loader are going into position um, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode guys I will finish up with some of these course play courses um, and get the uh, mower by the silage facility and we will look at setting up a course play course for the mower so that way we can just harvest it all that way all right guys uh, this is Dally don't forget to like and subscribe if you uh, enjoyed the video. If not, please leave a comment. Um, if you did like it, uh, comment as well. I would like to know 
what I'm doing, good or bad. Um, so please keep me informed on that information. Uh, you guys have fun.